What is up guys? Welcome back to another Instagram tutorial. My name is Steven Womack and today I want to show you how Short Stash edits his pictures. You requested him. Uh, he's also known as Garrett King. That's his normal name on Instagram Short Stash and he does that teal and orange travel photography and he does really high quality pictures. Uh, I think he uses really high quality cameras as well. So it'd be hard to get the exact look using your smartphone only. But in terms of color grading, I will show you exactly what to do in the free Lightroom app to create the same teal and orange colors that he uses. Now let me tell you, I've created a preset pack with all of the presets that you will need for 2020 to make your pictures look amazing. You can just copy the settings of the presets and paste them to your pictures to get those colors high quality and really interesting. Check them out, the link is under this video. It goes straight to my website where you can download the whole pack. Also, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my tutorials. I'm really grateful for every subscriber that I have on YouTube at the moment, and this channel is growing, which makes me super happy. Thank you so much. Also, if there's anything I can do for you, anything you need, check me out on Instagram. My handle is at Stephen Womack. I'm always up for conversation and I really like to receive your feedback telling me what you think about my channel and what I can do for you next. And I've said enough, let's jump right into the tutorial and of course, first of all, you want to open up that Lightroom app and I've chosen this picture that comes really close to that scenery that uh, Garrett King uses in his pictures. And in terms of the settings, what you want to do first of all is hit that curves button in the light section on the upper right and I want you to copy this curve exactly as it is here, super easy. Just pull down the highlight button on the right or that highlight knob and then just pull out in the middle a little bit to get a, a curve, um, a little bow curve in there just slightly. So that's perfect. When you have this copied then we're done here. Now what you want to do is pull down the exposure to negative 0 0.70 and the contrast you want to boost that up to plus 11. The highlights you want to pull all the way down to negative 100. The shadows we want to boost them up to plus 55. The whites what we want to do is pull them down all the way to negative 80, 82, and the blacks, we want to boost them up a little bit to about plus 20 is perfect. Then we're done with the lights here, so we jump over to that colors panel, and what we want to do here is scroll down and pull down the saturation halfway to negative 50 right there. Now we scroll up and hit the color mix button. And for the red tones, we don't want to change anything. So we go over to the orange tones and here we want to pull down the hue to around negative 10. The saturation, we want to boost that back up to plus 36. And the luminance, we want to pull down all the way to negative 73. Now we go over to the yellow tones, we want to pull down the hue to that orange area to around negative 52 and the saturation we want to boost that up to about plus 18 and for the luminance we want to pull down all the way to negative 30 33 is good now we go over to the green tones and here we want to just pull down the saturation all the way so there's no green in the picture and the luminance as well all the way to negative 100. Now we go over to the aqua tones and here you'll leave the hue at zero and the saturation what we want to do is pull it down to negative 50, 52 is good and the luminance we also want to pull that down all the way to negative 100 and the blue tones this is the final thing we're going to do in the color mix. Uh, we want to pull the hue to negative 70 and the saturation we want to pull that down to negative 80, 86 is good and for the luminance we want to pull that down all the way to negative 100 so we get that really dark gray sky uh, that Short Stash uses as well. 
And for the purple and pinks, we'll not change anything. So we're done here and we go over to the effects panel. Now what you want to do here is pull down the texture to around negative 20 and the and then we dehaze and we push that up to around plus 29 is good. And then we're done here. So we scroll up to that split toning tab here. And what we want to do is pull the hue of the highlights all the way over to 42 and a saturation of 25 is good. So it's 43, 23 is good as well. And for the shadows, we want to pull all the way to a hue of 193 and a saturation of around 4 is perfect. So it's 149 and 4. And now what you can see is that the colors are on point already, but there's a little, uh, it's a little rough up in the sky. You can really see the pixels. So we're done here and we go over to the detail section and we can easily fix this by just pulling in a noise reduction of about 29 and a color noise reduction. And this is where the magic happens to around 40 is good. And now you can see that that noise and that grain in the sky just vanished and it looks pretty soft pretty clear so we're done here this is the final result i really like uh, how it turned out it comes really close to that garrett king type picture and um i think we did a good job here i'm really excited to see what you guys come up with if you need more than this look i've created amazing presets for you just check them out on my website the link is under this video you can download them and just copy them and paste them to all of your pictures to make them look great and get ready for 2020. Also, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notifications bell so you don't miss out on my next tutorials. And check me out on Instagram at Stephen Womack and let me know what else I can do for you, uh, what tutorial I can do next. I'm always trying to read through all of your comments under this video and catch up with all of the Instagram DMs to really uh, satisfy you guys and get you what you need uh, for 2020. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Peace.